Hi, it's Lucy Edson for Shimmers Paints. We've teamed up with Petaloo and some of their paintable flowers to um, share some techniques with you using Shimmers and Petaloo together. I'm going to show a technique that I am um, working on. I'm making kind of a lace doily effect out of the flowers. And I'm just going to make a simple card to show this. I've got a um, piece of cardstock that's just a simple card uh, folded into a card shape. And I have my Petaloo flowers. I have three colors of Shimmers paints that I'm going to be mixing together to make a blended effect. I have burgundy, bubblegum, and flashy fuchsia. I'm going to start by just dampening the background to kind of help my paper colors, um, paint colors all blend together. And for that I'm using Shimmer Spritz in Baby's Breath. Just so it doesn't really add any color, just a little extra shimmer. And I'm just going to roll it up to mix the um, color in from the bottom and just lightly spritz. I'm only going to be do working on one half. Okay, and it will lift a little bit, but that's fine. I'm going to be able to flatten it all out when I'm finished. I'm working on black so that you can see the contrasts with the paint colors. I have already opened my bottles or my little jars of paint and pre-mixed them. Uh, that's important to do so that you get all the glimmer that's, that um, is in the bottom. And I'm just using a paintbrush and I'm going to start mixing. I'm going to try to kind of get a watercolor effect. So I'm just going to dip, dip into these and start painting. I don't want to overwork this because I want it to have that, like I said, that soft watercolor effect. And so I'm going to let this set up. I'm going to do just a tiny bit of spritzing on the top to just kind of make everything blend a little more. And just lightly spritz and you can see the colors just completely blending. I really like that. So I'm going to let this dry and then I'm going to come back and arrange the flowers in a pattern over it to resemble a lace doily. Um, to get them to, to fit. So I'm going to arrange all these up while... Um, It'll take me a minute to arrange everything the way I want, and then I'm going to come back and um, attach these down. Okay, now I've arranged the flowers the way I would like them to be, and so I'm just going to attach them down with a little bit of glue on the back side. And um, you could use glue dots or um, do a little tape runner on the back, and uh, or you could even coll actually collage them down more with um, some gel medium. But I think just a little bit of glue on these will work, and I'm just going to... Stick these all down with a little bit of liquid glue on the back. Um, then I'm going to take um, and trim these away so the edges are nice and flat whenever I've glued everything down. So I'm going to go ahead and complete the gluing and then I will um, show you how I'm going to finish this off. I wanted to add one more element to my card. I've at this point trimmed my card out and picked out a little sentiment and chipboard area frame to just kind of finish it off. And I thought how cute it would be to make a butterfly to go um, on this part of the card. So I took one of the flowers, it's a larger five petal one, and I removed um, one petal and I have a pipe cleaner. I'm going to make um, a butterfly, fly dimensional butterfly. And I want, first want to paint it or you know get some color on it. So I've got Shimmers Vibes in Sunset Strip. Just going to roll that up and because I think a pop of yellow would really make that card look really springy and fresh. So I've got my shimmers and I'm going to get the color on that. I love the vibes. The colors are so intense. And then I also have one of my little pots of shimmers paints. This one is called Magenta. The pipe cleaner. Kind of weave it around through the middle and um, trim the stems to make a dimensional butterfly to go on my card. So I think that'll end up as a great little finishing touch and a fun way to alter one of your flowers. And here's my completed card with my little butterfly and um, my sentiment glued on. I just think it turned out really pretty and I will take some shots outside so you can see how gorgeous the shimmer and shine is on this. And I uh, just want to say thanks to Petaloo and Shimmers for sponsoring us with this lovely product. And um, we'll see you soon.